Hey, how's it going? Funny thing, I made this video already. And it disappeared from my program and it disappeared from my uh, computer. So I cannot find it. So I'm assuming God said, the ancestors said, you from the future said, Jay, that one wasn't good enough. You have to make another one. So I'm gonna make another one. I have some more time to think about this. So let's talk about how to make the Pisces woman fall in love. I had this question from a supporter. I don't usually take questions from people because all my videos are divinely inspired. But somehow this led, you know, this gave me some more divine inspiration. So thank you whoever made ask that question. Now, I am going to say you can't just make someone fall in love with you, you know. You know, you don't ever want to make someone fall in love with you against their will and your will. Because, you know, it'd, it'd be kind of like a trick. I do believe love is something that happens naturally. Now say, say you got this, oh, you got this pretty little Pisces lady on your eye, on your target. And you're like, you know, as a man, there's something that happens. Or if you're a woman, if you're a woman too, there's something that happens when you go, you know what? I'm going to knock that thing. Mm. I'm going to do it no matter what. <laughs> it's something that happens, uh, you know, once you have that determination to get someone. It depends how far you're going to go. But anyway, this is going to be some inside information as a Scorpio man. You know, a lot of people in my family are Pisces. My brother, my sister-in-law, both of my parents are Pisces. And... The lady I have right now is a Pisces, and I have a lot of experience with Pisces women. Scorpios do get along with Pisces very well, so I'm going to give you my perspective as a Scorpio man, all right, how to get that Pisces lady and to love her properly, because everybody speaks their own language. So let's begin. Welcome back to the Scorpio Scriptures Podcast. I'm your host, Master Jay. This is where we talk about astrology, all things Scorpio related, and the expansion of consciousness. So today... We're going to start off a new series. It's how to make X, Y, and Z fall in love with you. Of course, we are always going to start with the Pisces or the Virgo woman. Because those are my two favorite. After Scorpio woman, of course. But that's a given. Now, you know, someone's, there's always going to be one person to go, That's not me. You're totally wrong, Jay. Da, 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 da. I know, I know, I know. You're the Pisces that doesn't work this way. <laughs> but... I find that a majority of people with the heavy Pisces energy, whether it's rising, moon, sun, Venus, uh, especially the moon and the rising, they this will hit them real hard and the sun. Now, Pisces woman, let's break down the Pisces woman. One of my most popular videos is on the Pisces woman because I love Pisces woman. Mom's a Pisces woman. Love your mom. Thanks for everything. Now, as a man, you're trying to, or a woman, you're trying to charm the Pisces woman. What you want to know about her? The Pisces woman feels everything. The Pisces being the last sign of the zodiac, they are one of the most understanding of all women. It is believed that they are an accumulation of all signs combined into one. So they are able to shift in and out of different frequencies and a body of certain energies. Now, Pisces women, are they some of the most understanding, some of the most empathetic, some of the most caring, sometimes to a fault. Caring to a fault and wise woman that you will come across. Now, their energy is somewhat spread out, right? It's like a Scorpio's energy and like a Aries energy. Now, the energy is very direct. And focus like a laser. A Pisces energy is not really it's focused like a laser. It's kind of like one day it's like this. Uh, one day should be mad. One day should be vicious. One day should be angry. One day should be sad. Uh, it might happen all in one day. But it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful woman. Because she is really 12 women in one. <laughs> She's really 12 women in one. She embodies all the traits of this. So you have to understand the Pisces woman, she feels everything. You know, she feels the shades of life. She understands pain and she understands love. So especially when you are trying to court her or especially as a man, I do believe you should always be courting your woman. 
<laughs> you know, you shouldn't, you, you should never just stop. A relationship in the beginning, people tend to try hard in the beginning. Actually, you should always try hard if you truly love someone. You should never have a dull moment. That's what I believe. Now, the Pisces woman, she feels everything. So, it's wise to understand that if you talk to certain people one way, you may have to talk to her a little differently and be more clear in your communication. Uh, especially if you are a very blunt person like myself. It is easy to hit the Pisces a little too hard. <laughs> the Pisces woman is one of the women, uh, similar to a Libra woman or Taurus woman, where you don't need to push too hard with them. All right, there are certain women of certain signs where you can back and forth and make fun of them and laugh at them and insult them even, and they won't take it personally. And I find that with Pisces women, you don't really do that that often because they think of things and they think of everything and they feel everything. So if they're not used to you being that way in the beginning, you may come off uh, wrong, you may come off insulting, you may come off brash. And especially with this woman, she is a very, mm, she's a very sensual, she's a very, whoo, she's a very free flowing woman. So she does not take to things like violence very well or extreme aggression very well. Although she may be attracted to those men, she does not, you know, this woman out of all women, it's not one to really <laughs> take aggression very well. You know, they they may have their moments, you may have your moments, but you don't need to be as hard as these women. Actually, with a Pisces woman, the best thing you can do is be uh, romantic. The best thing you can do with a Pisces woman is to be romantic and loving and uh, soft and sensual. You can really show your soft side to this woman. And the best thing is to remember the little things about her and to push her to grow because this is a woman who feels everything. She feels everything and she thinks about everything and she wanders about everything. And you may not notice her love for you in the beginning it may be very, very deep, but she might not show it very much. She'll show it uh, in the little things that she does. There's a lot of thought behind what she does. And that is the type of love that I notice that Pisces woman appreciates the most reciprocated to her. It's not when well, this woman is a romantic woman. You know, it's the small things that will melt her heart. It is noticing the flowers that she likes. It's noticing the little coffees uh, that she likes, the little drinks that she likes. It is noticing all those small little things she does because everything she does, there's actually a lot of thought and depth into it. She is, she sometimes is a little shy. She sometimes is a little nervous, but sometimes she is very outgoing and you will have to know your woman better than she knows herself. I always say a man should know his woman better than he knows her. She knows herself and vice versa. That is uh, one of the best signs of true love. It is knowing what your partner will do beforehand. And a Pisces woman, she does act in a very subtle way. Her movements are very subtle and very smooth. The way she talks and the way she walks and the way she acts. It is a uh, very, very uh, smooth. Like... Like glides, she kind of glides through the universe. And if you take notice of the way she does things, you will see the thought behind everything she does. And there's a lot of love in the things she does. There's a lot of care in the things she does. So to love this woman, to help her or to help yourself, you know, love her the way she wants to be loved is to understand uh, her language, her language of love is, it, it really is the little things. It really is the little things. It really is, you know, noticing certain things about her and letting 
her know how much you appreciate it. Letting her know how special she is. Letting her know that you know it's okay to believe in yourself. It's okay to push yourself. It's okay if you want to do something, you can do it. If you like this thing, you know, let's go get it. Now, sometimes a Pisces woman, she is in her head a lot. She might have trouble with、uh, adequate plans, or she might just have trouble with kind of being a wallflower. These women are kind of like wallflowers; they're very shy, so they will need a man、uh, most times to take the lead. And they love just kind of,、uh, you know, sitting back and being ladies. These women are the most. Some of the most womanly of women. They're some of the most beautiful and womanly of women, and you don't want to take the things that they do for you for granted, because you might not notice them at first. You might not notice、uh, how she loves you. You might not notice she knows you're working, so she won't text you at a certain time. She knows you like this food, so she'll just get you it. You know,、uh, she almost at times a Pisces woman is too. It's too giving in love, and it's very easy for her to、mm, almost fall victim to the idea of love itself. So many times, a Pisces woman can fall to a, a sweet talking romantic or a classical bad boy, a classical player, and they can fall in love with a man's potential. They can fall in love with the way that the man makes them feel. And they could be blinded by rose-colored glasses. So, you know, to love a Pisces woman properly is you gotta be the real deal for these women, right? You don't want to hurt these women because when these women are hurt, they're deeply, deeply, deeply hurt because they、uh, they really love love and they really live from a place of love and they're very idealistic women. You know, they see the world in an ideal way. And they see the world in a very good and a healthy and loving way. You know, they are the type of woman that just will love、uh, everything. You know, they just want to love everything, and they just want to be loved with a true love. Though a Pisces woman is a woman that looks for true love, a true romance, and a man who can be、uh, tender with her, but also aggressive when he needs to, not too forceful. Not too forceful, just enough, because she will get the message, you know, just enough. You don't need to. No, come on, get over here. No, she, hey, let's go this way. It's okay. Come on. You know, the Pisces woman. She's a magical woman. She is a magical woman. She's a beautiful, beautiful woman. They have the sweetest spirits, and they have the most understanding out of all women. And there was a part. In the Pisces woman, when she falls in love with the right man or woman, but you know it's usually man. And so, this case, I'm assuming it is you. That inside of her, there's like a little ball of jello, and it just makes her like, whew, like.、Mm. It's hard to explain the energy of these women when they fall in love. They get all giddy and they get and they move a certain way and you can tell they just melt. They just melt like butter in them in their man's hands. And it's an experience, man. It is an experience loving a Pisces woman and being in love with one. They really make you want to be a better person. They have such ideal views and they are so.、Uh, I would even say pure-hearted. They're very pure-hearted women. And they're usually aiming to be、uh, good people in life. That there's a type of woman that a man meets, where it amplifies his strength and his leadership. The saying goes: behind every successful man was an influence of a modest woman, sometimes that the public may never hear about, and that. Pops in my head is ultimately a Pisces woman. She is that type of woman who you want to take care of. And if you're a woman, or if you're like a super feminist listening to this, you might not understand. Men naturally want to take care of women. 
but only a certain type of woman. And a Pisces woman, she has that about her. There are women in this world who you meet and you want to, <clears throat> I want to have sex with you. <laughs> you know, there are women that you meet that are your mistress. There are women that you meet that are, you know, you like her, but you know you're not compatible. Now, Pisces woman is the woman that you meet and you want to shield her from the world and you want to give her everything. You want to protect her and give her everything. That is the nature of man when he meets uh, a woman that hits that spot in him, right? Every man has a spot in him, and every woman has a spot in her, right? Women find certain men attractive, but they might not want to marry him, or they might not want to have children with him, right? The Pisces woman over, she has that energy that, you know, it, it, it does something to a man, and you get that idea that if you cannot do that if you cannot provide that for her if you are not willing to be that man in her life uh, you shouldn't do that because this woman loves very hard this woman loves very hard they have a deep sense of love and being loved and when they are in love i do believe that is when they are the most mm, i would say at home home Love is home for the Pisces woman. These women will flourish in love and they will really blossom when they're in love with the right person. So to love them, you must understand uh, what you are dealing with. It's a very idealistic woman. It's not a woman that you should just have a fling with. You know, because uh, it's pretty messed up. Uh, it is a woman that you want to encourage to bring out her gifts and you want to tell her how much you love her. You want to sweet talk her. These women, they will fall for a sweet talker. So you don't, <laughs> you know, they, they, they have to be careful. They need to have like a family member or something watching their back. Because once they become jaded or once they become damaged, uh, they could uh, become very deeply hurt. I mean, very, very really deeply hurt and they may shut off the idea of love forever so a pisces woman feels everything very deeply and she feels the pain of the homeless and she feels the pain of the sick and she feels the pain of those you know with stories that you know, of unfortunate events and she can get sucked into them and she cares about everyone so that's a man or her mate you would ideally be the one to kind of guide her in a direction where she is not exhausting herself or burning herself out because she gives so much to the world that you want to give some of the love that she gives out back to her right you want to show her that you care truly about this woman and there's nothing wrong with apologizing to her and there's nothing wrong with even becoming having a softer side for her because this is a woman that she forgives you know she's very idealistic she will forgive you if you do her wrong she will speak to you again if you hurt her but you shouldn't take advantage of that the pisces woman in love is very you know uh she she, she really changes when she is in love so you have to see that as not as a weakness but as a gift from god that you have this woman who acts this way when she loves you it's not something to take advantage of you don't want to take advantage of the pisces woman because they they fall in love very 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 deeply just how she feels everything right she feels the different shades of everything she also feels the different shades of love and she feels everything she swims in love she swims in the emotions she swims in the things that you said to her and it makes her melt it makes her like <sighs> all right at times a pisces woman they can fall in love and you know they just everything goes out the door they love with all of their being and and uh, sometimes it's hard for them to get sense of it. 
so the man or whoever is courting the woman should understand. They will have a very, very caring person who sometimes is detached from the world and should be treated very well. The Pisces woman should be treated very well. There's little things. It is the little things with the Pisces woman. The things that other people may not care about, she cares about because she thinks about everything. The little kiss in the morning, the good night, the nicknames, the remembering what she likes. Those things. She lives for those things. She does not need the world. She does not need the world. She just needs to feel cared for, like how she cares for other people, and reciprocating that back to her. Uh, you know, these women, especially as a Scorpio man, are probably uh, my favorite favorite woman to be around. They just are. They just are very, very sweet women. They're very, very sweet. Even when they get mad. You know, they get mad. Of course, everyone gets mad. But... You know, Pisces woman is, is different. It's different. They are the equalizers of the Zodiac. They can kind of do anything, anywhere. And... Take on the energy of anything... They can get along with probably all sorts of people. And they have a great gift. They have a great ability. <clears throat> and that is they see and feel everything. So you have to remember that the Pisces woman. She feels the shades of life. Whereas you see a rainbow with seven colors, she sees a rainbow with 7,000 colors. Oh, you have to understand the the feeling that this woman feels is very deep. It is very deep. So you don't want to play with this woman's heart. You want to be uh, more straightforward and not come on too strong. Kind of guide her through love and let her know you through love and let her know that you actually care for her, right? This is a... She is a romantic woman. A very romantic woman. Very, very, very romantic. She loves love. And when these women are in love, they are the most sweet, sweetest woman. I'm telling you, if you get a Pisces woman, you have something very special. Because they really dedicate themselves in love. And they really... Their love is vast. It's like the ocean. It's vast like the ocean. And it's never ending like the galaxy. It just keeps on going and going and going. And it takes on so many different forms of love. And it takes on so many different small little actions. And when this lo woman loves you, it will really change you. So you should be able to understand her and reciprocate this to her so I hope you enjoyed that